We have to really love God. Now, this is easy to fake if you grew up in the South and you grew up in church because you know the lingo. You know what you're supposed to say, where you're supposed to be. Sometimes people fake really loving God. And when they fake really loving God, it's from a heart that, that really thinks of God like this. They, they love God for what he can do for them and only when they need it done. It's a, it's a God of convenience. It's a sort of a, a genie in the bottle, if you will. They love God and they're, and they're kind of their fake love of God. They love God for what he can do for them and only when they need him. And the, the action, the way that you can see this in their life is that they're, and if you've ever experienced this, which I have, I know what this is like, that you, you work hard to maintain the perception that you love God. You uh, would extend your tassels if you were a Jew in that day because you want people to think you really love God. You might exhaust yourself trying to do things to prove that you really love God when in effect you only love what one pastor I have served with said. Uh, you like his presence from his hands, E-N-T-S, what he can give you more than you care about his presence, E-N-C-E, who he is and being with him. There's a difference. Thank you.